The 5R110 transmission is very stout under normal power conditions, but if you've made any performance upgrades, your 5R could be headed to early failure. Today on XDP Tech Tips, we're going to be talking about the direct clutch solenoid and why it's such an important modification for your 5R110 transmission found in 6 liter and 6.4 liter power strokes. So Mike, what's the function of the clutch solenoid? Well, the function of the XD306 is actually to apply transmission fluid to the direct drive clutch when commanded by the TCM. And are there any common signs that the solenoid is not working properly? Some of the common signs would be uh, either slipping when the direct drive clutch is actually engaged or actually a lazy or very soft feeling shift. And what could possibly happen to the vehicle if these signs go unnoticed or unresolved? If left unattended over time, this definitely could lead towards transmission failure. So what makes this solenoid an upgrade from the factory? Well, the factory solenoid works okay under normal driving conditions and stock horsepower. But what makes the XD306 an upgrade is that the fact that it can supply more fluid faster to the direct drive clutch to get that firmer, uh, crisper shift. You mentioned the stock solenoid is okay in a stock horsepower setting. For our customers who aren't adding horsepower, is there any benefits to installing this upgrade? Yeah, there's definitely huge be benefits by just the firmer, crisper shifts and the added firm hold you have on the uh, direct drive clutch back is just adding life to the transmission. Is there any technical tips you could deliver to our viewers watching this? Well, this solenoid might not be compatible with all aftermarket tuners, so it is wise to check with your tuner prior to installing this. Now that we know more about the direct clutch solenoid, let's show you how we install one of these in our power stroke. First, we need to get the necessary tools to upgrade our solenoid. We'll need a 3 8 inch ratchet, a 3 8 inch extension, a 10 millimeter socket, and 13 millimeter socket, pliers, a clean drain pan, and a torque wrench. Using a 13 millimeter socket, remove the drain plug on the transmission pan and drain the fluid into a clean drain pan. Using a 10 millimeter socket, remove all the transmission pan bolts. Remove the transmission filter and solenoid connector from the direct clutch solenoid. Remove the solenoid retainer clip. Finally, remove the solenoid. Install your new solenoid at a 6 o'clock position and then rotate to 7 o'clock position. Remember the included plastic cap must remain installed on the end of the solenoid or damage to the transmission can occur. Apply light pressure to the solenoid to reinstall the solenoid retaining e-clip and reconnect the solenoid connector. Reinstall the transmission filter. Clean and reinstall the transmission pan with the pan gasket. Torque the transmission pan bolts to 11 foot-pounds and drain plug to 13 foot-pounds. Finally, add the fluid to the recommended level. Check the fluid level with the vehicle running at operating temperature and transmission in park position and top off as needed. Get the XDP modified direct clutch solenoid for your truck at XDP.com or contact your local dealer.